Hello there, let's talk about the real link camera not connecting to the Wi-Fi. As you can see, I have a real link Argos 2E and a real link Argos 3. Both of them are connected here to my cell phone, but sometimes it doesn't work, it doesn't connect. So let me show you here what could be the problem and what's the solution, okay? So at first here, uh, you can have a problem when the camera is trying to read the QR code and also when the camera is trying to connect to the router, right? Okay, you have two different router here. In fact, I have the main router and I have a repeater, okay? Let me just show here this camera, the Reolink Argus 2E. When I click here, and you see the Wi-Fi the camera is connected to. That's the name of the Wi-Fi. And then I can click here to change to a different Wi-Fi. So I have more Wi-Fi in the network. And it's important here to connect to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. Don't try to use five gigahertz because it doesn't work with these cameras, right? That could be one of the problem, but also could be the problem related to reading the QR code. Let me just remove here the real link Argo 3. I'll come here and remove the camera. So let me just delete it here and I'll start over so you'll see how it works, okay? I will leave the real link Argus 2E connected and I will just connect this new one, the Argus 3, okay? So here, I click to select the camera, to add the camera, then I can read the QR code using the cell phone camera. Let me just get the camera here, put it there, and it reads the QR code. Here we go, I hear a beep, and I need to select here Wi-Fi not configured. Don't select Wi-Fi already configured, okay? So you need to come here to Wi-Fi not configured. Click here. And now make sure the device is on. It is. I click next. And here I hear this message. Uh, I have heard the voice prompt. I didn't, okay? I didn't hear anything here. No device prompt and no sound from the camera. So that's a mistake. You can't continue from here. You need to restart your camera, to reset your camera, then you can start over. Let me just do this. So what I have to do is just get the camera, open here, and there's this hole where you can reset your camera to factory default. Let me just use this paper clip, put it here, click and hold. Okay, so I heard the sound. I'm just closing here. Put it back. You know, the camera makes this sound, and there and there's this sonar sound. Now the camera is ready to go. Let me just make sure that I'm okay and come back from the beginning. Okay, read the QR code again. Just put it here. There you go. Wi-Fi not configured, remember that. Next, and here I have heard the voice prompt. It's not a voice prompt, depending on the camera, you can hear voice or you can hear this sonar sound. That's the case, my sonar sound. I click here and next. And here it's important to select your, your Wi-Fi. Right now, let me just try with my repeater, okay? So you can see if I have a problem or not. So here I can't change to a different Wi-Fi. I'm using Wi my iPhone here, so I select my Wi-Fi, here click and hold, and I select a different one, let me just select here this, uh, let me just come back again one more time, this one, okay? Then I come back here to the main screen, and now I have a different Wi-Fi, let me just input the password, there we go, the password is here, I click next. Now it's time to scan the QR code. It's important to follow the instructions here, you see? There's a correct distance. So make sure you have this distance. So now it's time to read the QR code. Not now, you see that uh, the QR code is here, but it's a little, dip, a little bit dimmed, you see? We can't see that that well, right? Sometimes that's a problem with the Wi-Fi. You can print this QR code. You can take a picture of this QR code, use another phone and try from there. Sometimes that, that could be the problem, okay? Let me just try to scan the QR code now with the camera. So here we go. 
So as you can see, at, at this distance, it's not working. So you need to move away. Still not working. And here we go. I got this distance and then it's working now. Sometimes I just need to move the cell phone to a different position like this. So I get a better light or things like that, right? So just make sure you try harder. Moving away, change it to a different position. And there you go. Now it could read the QR code, click here and next. And here I heard the voice prompt or at least the sound from the camera, I click next. And now it's trying to connect to the camera. I will probably have a hard time connecting the camera because I'm trying to use the repeater there. So if it doesn't work, I need to restart my repeater or try to connect to the different Wi-Fi. I don't know if you have more than one Wi-Fi at home, right? But if you don't, just restart your router and try again. You see, that's the problem that I have in here. It's not working. I, uh, I see this message and also I, I heard, I hear this sound that indicates that's not working. Then I need to try to try over. I try here, reconfigure and come back again to this first stage, right? And I hear the sonar sound here. If I don't hear this, I need to reset the camera again. But as long as I'm, I'm here, this sound, I, I'm good to go. I'm just grab my camera again, put it here, read the QR code. Wi-Fi not configured. Next. I heard the voice prompt. In here now, I will change the Wi-Fi again. So let me just come here, click and hold, click and hold again, and select a new Wi-Fi here. Here we go, connected to the new Wi-Fi. Back there. And you see, it's a different one now. Let me just insert the password. Okay, now I have the password. I just click next. Now it's time to read the QR code again. Remember the distance is about 12 inch or 25 to 30 centimeters. Scan now. And let me grab the camera, put it here. About this distance, just move the cell phone a little bit. And there we go. You see the distance? That's the one, okay? So I heard the sound, put the camera back here and click here, next. I have heard the voice prompt, next again. Now it's trying to connect and you see, faster now. It connected to my new Wi-Fi. Let me just insert here a password. There we go, a new password. Hit return and next. Just name my device, Reolink Argos 3, click next, next again, and done, okay? And click here to connect to the camera, and I'm ready to go. So it's basically working, all right? So guys, every time I try this and it doesn't work, I just do this process. I try to scan the QR code in a different way, different distance, different light uh, to the cell phone. Uh, I also try to scan the QR code to take a picture of the QR code so it can read from another cell phone or even print using paper. And also try different Wi-Fi uh, router, repeater, whatever you have there. Restart the router as well. And it always work. Okay, sometimes I have a hard time with the Reolink Argus 2E. I do this and it works. The Argus 3 is the same. Okay, so it's basically more on the router side and more on the cell phone side when you read the QR code, okay? So usually it works. So that's the way you can solve the problem with the real link camera not connecting to the Wi-Fi. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments, and I see you in the next one.